guys, Crystal and Shadow here, back with Pokemon Emerald, and we are here in this route, and let's double check, yeah, team is healed. Um, in the remake, this house would have healed you, but instead it's just a bunch of Wingles. There's still Wingles in the remake, but there's also a healing person. Ah. And if you were playing the original, like we are, there's a hell's chance of catching a Feebas in that lake. Yeah. Don't, don't try and do it. I feill sorry for people who had to complete the poke decks in Gen 3 and 4. Mm. Thankfully, after that they finally fixed Feebas. Yeah. Speaking of Feebas, there's a Nintendo Direct tomorrow. Mm. So, there's a very good chance we'll have our very last Smash Brothers character. Oh yeah. So that'll be interesting. One last chance for it to be Crash Bandicoot. Who else? That could be anyone. Feebas is like the only Pokemon that has multiple ways of evolving into the same Pokemon. Oh yeah, because they changed it in Gen 5 because they got rid of contests. But, fun fact, in Gen 5, if you transfer a Feebas from Gen 4 to 5, it can, and it's had max beauty before being transferred, Yeah. it will still evolve. So it can have both ways. Yeah, yeah. And I believe in Gen 6, when the contest came back, it still works where you got both options, I think. Mm. Which is good, because yeah, I'm so glad A, better ways to evolve it, B, better ways to catch it, and C, James once bought a mag James once bought a Feebas and it was just painted Magikarp. Mm. Well, this isn't going well at all. That's okay. So we use the grass type to fight the grass type. Yep. But yeah, don't know what else will be in the Nintendo Direct. I suppose, well, we'll probably get a bit more information about the new Mario Party, which I can't wait for. I doubt we'll get Pokemon information because they're never in Nintendo Directs. I don't really know what else games are coming out this year. Hmm. Maybe more Animal Crossing stuff. Please give us an update! I've had no reason to play the game! <laughs> For the love of God, just give us the cafe building! I would really love a cafe building. And after all this time, if it turns out the cafe is just in a museum, I'll be so annoyed. Because I would actually prefer a cafe building. Yeah. Because I've still got a spot where it can go. Oh, yes, I know exactly where mine can go. Now that I've moved things around recently. Yeah, I, from day one, I left a spot because I knew I would need it just in case they bring a, give us a new building. Mm. Whereas some people have their towns all planned out and they and they have no spot for a new building. Yeah, I know, but I always left room. I figured it's either a forest or I can put a cafe there. True. I've got plenty of spaces for stuff. Well, just give me any don't go yeah go between them. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know what else. I don't know what else they could put in Animal Crossing. Well, people have been data mining, and people are pretty sure the cafe is coming. Yeah, but they've been saying that for a year. Yeah, but I saw a screenshot of Brewster, like, standing in the plaza like kicks. They really need to give us... Why would you not use your grass move on the water type? Oopsie. They really need to, like, give us more ways for the old characters to come back, even if they're in new ways. I don't know how, but they need to find ways for like Shampoodle or the police officers to come back. Mm. I don't know who else needs to come back. Yeah. Oh, and um, oh wait, no, they did bring back Reese and the other dude. That was uh, in, yeah. that was in the, that... we the wedding thing. Yeah. Um, what else is there to bring back? I don't know. Give us a whole new building we've never had before. Hmm. I like the dance club. Oh yeah. Yeah, and he's not in this game, is he? 
No, we haven't seen Trunk. No, because his main purpose was giving you reaction shots, but that's gone. Yeah. Because animals just give it to you. But, I don't know, they could still give us a dance club. I liked that. Yeah. But KK already performs in the plaza. I know. On this side? There's an item, and then there's a double battle, and then there's a wild battle against... Ooh, Catatropius. Okay. Uh, you can't use Leech Seed on a grass type, did you know that? No, I didn't remember that. Well, now you know. Ooh, we can even go for another one. Then it'll be a critical. I swear, I hate when it happens. Nice. What's worse is when you critical one-shot a Pokemon you're trying to catch, and you're like, well, great, now I don't know if I can one-shot it normally or not. Mm. You know, I actually liked in New Leaf when Phineas gave you badges. Oh yeah, they got rid of the- oh wait, no, because they've got the cis nook miles, yeah, yeah. Mm. Alright, what have we got now? What are we going to call it? Bananas. Okay, the A-N-A-N-A, yes. Maybe we'll see Make sure you step through the left part. I don't know if we'll use Tropy as much, considering we've got Brilliam. Well, step through the left so you get both trainers. Okay. Alright, this is a bird guy. It's gotta be a bird guy. Yeah. No, fire. Fire? Okay. of what I would have done. Okay. Ground is good against fire. Oh, I forgot that. Oh well, whatever. Still killed it. Oh look, he's got four anyway. That was terrible. Right, let's try this the correct way. Okay. That sound makes me think of Pokemon Pinball. <laughs> I like the way they re reuse all the different sounds in Pokemon Pinball. Mm. Well, it's a bit too strong. It was only magnitude 6. Magnitude 6 was yesterday. Yes, I know. Please don't do that. smart on purpose because they're not programmed as double. Yeah, I know. Go Mudslap King! Oh, no. Well, the Mudslap isn't actually that effective, but it's the only damaging move with a guaranteed way of doing accuracy loss. Mm -hmm. Okay, maybe the guy to the left is a bird bird. I think so. Just 
double check the front. Yeah, that's fine. Wait, if he's a bird man, I shouldn't put grass. No, you should not. You can try. I want to win with Soul Rock. Yeah. Roll out. Mm -hmm. He's dumb. Well, maybe he didn't have any better moves. We'll never know. <laughs> now, on to the Weather Institute. Because the team Aquagrunts are busy. They're trying to catch Beavis. <laughs> but they forgot this isn't a remake. Or you could just walk hack past them and then skip the weather institute altogether. But that's cheating. I know, I know. Played around with a walkthrough walls glitch. That's how you get shaman. Uh, that was a, a, an actual cheat, not a glitch. Well, I mean, there is a way to glitch it. I don't know how, but I know there oh, is. Oh, yeah, yeah, with tweaking on the bike. Okay, that too. Yeah, people have used tweaking to get to shaman and the others. Well, I wonder if they'll make Shaman an ex a, a um, downloadable Pokemon, or if they'll finally make it not downloadable. Yeah. I would really love if they made it not downloadable. Mm. Oh, please demote more. Granted, I think I think we both have Shamans in Pokemon Home, or at least I do. Mm. Yeah, well, I know how to walk through walls in Gen 1. So, anyone can do that. Yeah, you just gotta go to the Safari Zone, go in and then save, and then go out. Oh, yeah, you... They'll ask you if you want to come in. You say no, but it's still counting your steps. You keep walking out, and also, you gotta be poisoned. This comes in play later, and so... You count your steps, and you're gonna be near a bump because Their balls are touching. And the last step you take has to be right at the right as you jump over the bump. And then you're flying. As a kid, the only glitch I knew was just standing on a cut tree, and all you do is save where a cut tree was and then turn it off. Yeah. <laughs> And then he says your safari game is over, you get taken back to the safari gate. And then you're flying. And then you walk through walls. But the thing, the glitch goes away if you go through a door, which is why I said be poisoned so you can die and you can get sent outside. That works too. Well, in some games, when you die, you're standing in front of Nurse Joy. But in some, when you die, you're standing outside oh, yeah, the you're, Pokemon you're Center. Right. In, I think in most later games, they take you to Nurse Joy. Mm. Yeah, if we had trained up... Marsh Tomp as much as we trained up Azumarill, we'd have a Swamp Bird. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we ditched our starter. Yeah, I've done that. Oh, 
one time, so I think I've mentioned recently, I had an EV team. So I was playing the game while talking to a friend on the phone. And I was playing the start. So I said to the friend, quick, score bunny, sobble or grooky. And the friend said, oh, score bunny. And then... The answer is always score bunny. And then I revealed to him, I'm just going to throw it in the PC. I just need to pick one. And he got so insulted. Yeah, but okay, that still matters because it determines what Pokemon your starter and the champion will have. Yeah. Which means Leon got a little sobble. Yep. I like it better that way. Hmm. Yeah. If you give him Score Bunny, then he doubles up because he has Charizard. Yeah, that's true. But that's only if you pick Grookey. Mm. Well, one time I had a team with all three starters. Yeah, everyone's done that at some point in their life. I did it without trading back in the days of Crystal. Oh yeah, I did that in Crystal too. I learned that glitch before, it was cool. Because everyone made a fuss about it when it came out on the DS, but I did that way before. Oh yeah, yeah. There was lots of really dumb rumours back in the day before the internet oh was real. Oh my god. Like, there was a rumour like in, in Crystal that you could get like a skateboard. There were dumb rumours. Well, in Gen 1, there was a cut surfboard item. Or like, um, I remember reading, because back in Crystal, I could never get past the ice path, so I didn't know what to do, and then I started, and then apparently there was, like, fake news that there was ice skates you could get. <laughs> That'd be cool, they'd let you go any direction you want. Oh, that was an easy battle. Well, to be fair, we used our level 36 Azumarill. Yeah, but Gen 1 had a surfboard, and it, it actually functions if you hack it into the game. I think it just puts you onto a surfing Pokemon, though. Wonderful. Cast one time. There it is. Okay. Yes, I will nickname him. Oh, it's a boy this time. Good, because he is a... Wizard. I hate typing like this. Oh well. Healing up? Sure, why not? And with not. that item, we are going to sit here on the river. It's a nice day, we should enjoy the river view, and with that, we will see you next time when we'll head north to Fortree City. See you see next, next time, time, guys! guys.